today I quickly wanted to talk about a situation a lot of people face at work, which is how to handle spotlight situations. So what do I mean by that? So how many of you have been in the situation where you're in a meeting and all of a sudden someone asks you, hey, Raj, could you uh, finish that work immediately? And they just literally discuss about that task like about a minute ago. And then all of a sudden they put you on the spot and ask you to commit to something which you don't have any idea about, right? And then what do you do? You immediately say, oh yeah, okay, uh, I'll do that, I'll do that. And you rush to answer that because uh, you're caught by surprise and you do not know uh, how to react to certain situations like this. So that's why I have two strategies which could, which could help you when you're put on the spot in meetings or uh, during uh, discussions and groups and so on. So the first strategy is called ask clarifying questions. So say, for example, if um, someone asks you a question saying, hey, could you uh, complete this task by tomorrow end of day in a meeting? Instead of answering immediately, which would be usually your gut reaction, what you could do is first take a deep breath and then ask a clarifying question. And your clarify, clarifying question could be like, hey, could you please repeat that one more time? Or you could say, were you asking about this task which needs to be complete or the other task? Or you could say, hey, I have another priority task, but do you think that I could put a hold on that and then work on this one? So asking that clarifying question helps you uh, buy more time and helps you give time to think about how you want to answer uh, questions or things which are sprung on, sprung upon you like suddenly without you being ready for it. So ask clarifying questions. The second strategy which I coach people about is I will get back to you strategy. So what do I mean by that? So at any time, uh, you feel that you're getting cornered or you're uh, being forced to commit to something and you have to make a decision immediately, what you could say is, hey, let me get back to you on that because I don't have all the information right now, but I could uh, just gather some more uh, information about it and then I could get back to you after the meeting. So that is how you could use the I will get back to you strategy. Or you could say, um, I don't remember, say someone asks you a question about, hey, can you tell me how the system works? You could say, if you're, if you're not, um, uh, if you don't remember things, you could just say, hey, I don't remember uh, the full details about that system, but why don't I get back to you on that and then follow up in an email? So you see how this is working? It's called I will get back to you strategy and you can use that strategy whenever you are put in an uncomfortable situations or asked to commit to something which you don't wanna to commit to. So using these two strategies, you can get out of any uncomfortable situation in your work environment. So definitely keep that in mind.